representing the 20 to 26 foot class in the center console category. The Rabalo R242 Explorer has an overall length of 24 feet, a beam of 8 feet 9 inches, and a max horsepower rating of 350. Designed to run the family offshore in comfort, she has a draft of 20 inches, a dead rise of 22 degrees, a dry weight of 4,800 pounds, and a fuel capacity of 156 gallons. Now, let's hear more from our hosts, George Labonte and Rick Riles. Okay, the boat we're on today is the R242 Explorer. Now, the Rivalo R242, the regular R242 is a more sport-oriented, fishing type of, less frills boat, but this boat, the Explorer, is an entirely different animal. After spending the morning on this boat, I'd love to have my kids grow up on this boat. Does that make sense? Oh yeah, absolutely. Now think about it, you know, this boat is geared towards the guy who's gonna do some fishing, but really wants to take people out to have a good time and relax. One thing that's gonna be really important to you if you're a family boater is safety, and this is a really able sea boat. You know, this boat has a 22 degree dead rise on the bottom. I watched the boat from the outside all morning and saw you running in the boat, and this boat ran like a champ. We've got a lot to get to, why don't we start right up here? Since you went to all the trouble to put this lounge together, why don't we make good use of it? Man? <laughs> Grab a seat. Uh, I can always have a seat, buddy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wake me up when we're done. How about it? It's perfect, George. These bolster heights are okay, just where I want them to be. It's very cozy. You know what? This is neat, this configuration. It's actually, you can switch it up a few different ways. Now, you've got the filler piece in the center and the cushions here making this basically a sun lounge here added these takeout backrests here, the forward-facing backrest. This is nice just for sitting here, even for riding right up here. I mean, it's very comfortable. Now, you can remove this filler piece and have it open. You can take the cushions off and have it a casting deck, or you can add a table, which is on the boat too, and have a table in here to sit around and have a picnic lunch. So how's that for versatility? It's versatility and it's good use of space. It's one of the things that Robalo does really well. These forward fish box hatches, easy open latches. You don't have to remove the cushion easily. Lift it up, you're in the box right there, no problem. Wait before you take off too far, buddy. Don't walk past my favorite kind of console over Yeah, here. how can I ignore the 400 pound gorilla in the room? Your favorite forward opening console. Man, this thing is just unbelievable. It's five, five and a half feet of headroom down in there with a head in, in this one. I'm gonna tell you a word that keeps coming up over and over again as we do all these walkthroughs on these boats. Ergonomics. Let's talk about it on this console. All right, you gotta like the padding. I've especially cared for the wells up forward to put cell phones and stuff in. They won't slide back on top of it. I do like the dark. The black acrylic here is really nice. I mean, this is a really sporty, sexy looking console here, but this boat seats you perfectly. You can touch the wheel right there perfectly. And more importantly, this lowered level here of the top of the console really enables you to see well over the thing. I mean, just look at how open your view is right here. Another thing, this hard top, really sturdy, a well-built solid top. They bring the tubing inside the dimensions of the console here so it doesn't impede in the space when you're walking past. You've got plenty of room to move right here. How about putting a bolster here on so you side. can sit down on the side, watch the lines, and still be perfectly comfortable? Let's work our way to the back of the boat. There's two innovations back there that I'll bet you lunch you can't even find. All right, let's see these hidden features you're Let talking about. Let me tell about. you something, buddy. Something I never would have thought of. This cooler that's under here? Yeah. What if we need a bigger box of water toys under there tomorrow for taking the kids? You raise the bar, you can slide anything under there. Adjustable, I like it, I like it. All right, you find the other one yet? You're gonna have to help me out here, what do we got? You buying lunch? Maybe. Ta-da! You wondered where the insert up there, where you did it, what you did with it? Fits perfect right down here, you latch it closed, it's gone. Unbelievable. That will be a um, Philly cheesesteak. Okay, you got the cheesesteak, and that's a great place to put that table. That's a great idea. We've got fiberglass built-in lounge area, this seating right here. Tell me about it. Oh, it's ideal, George. First, for cruising, for having the kids, it's perfect. But if you want to fish, you've got a live well over here, you've got storage right underneath me, and you've got a walk-through transom door that leads to something you really like. That transom platform is much wider here. You can walk back and forth across it easily. The swim ladder folds into a pocket there. That's gonna get the kids in and out of the boat easier, but more room to walk around back there, I like it. If you're looking for a boat that's gonna make the whole family happy, the Rabalo R242 Explorer definitely deserves a look.